Scientists around the world are trying to find a cure for coronavirus. Researchers at America's University of California in Santa Barbara hope their ultraviolet research can help. CNN correspondent Scott Sheehan has the details. Harness the power of light. The UV LED project is developing new ways to create more efficient lighting. Here at UCSB, we make UV LEDs from scratch, which means we start with a semiconductor wafer and we build it up layer by layer. It's a project that has evolved over two decades on UCSB's campus. It started with developing lights for homes, winning the lead researcher a Nobel Peace Prize. More recently, the project turned its focus to cleaning something that's never been more important than now. So the, the purpose of UV LEDs is primarily for disinfection. That's the biggest application that we're really interested in. Um, so very short wavelength UV called UVC uh, is effective in killing germs. So it can be used for water disinfection, air disinfection, many other things in addition to that. The project started as a way to use UV LED light to disinfect water, but since the COVID-19 health pandemic, they're trying to use the same technology to disinfect personal protective equipment or other surfaces like air and water from the coronavirus. That's what we do. We increase the efficiency and the power of the lights. So as the efficiency and power increase, the time required to disinfect goes down. And in one case, I saw they were able to disinfect an entire surface in 30 seconds. UCSB researchers hope their more efficient LEDs can help other companies develop new technologies to fight COVID-19. And if the National Institute of Health or the NIH confirms it works, it could eventually be used to clean even more. We think it'll then eventually go into disinfection of personal protective gear, which has just recently been demonstrated by the NIH. Uh, hopefully someday air conditioning too, because as you know, the air on an airplane or in a bus currently isn't sterilized. Alcohol-based cleaners can cause surfaces to deteriorate over time, which is a problem for protective equipment. But that's not the case with UV LED, which can be a game changer.